Okay, so because of issues with recording, I ended up having a little bit to do. I got attacked by these things and decided to pull out my shotgun for them. Well, you kind of- all you really missed there was just me panicking a little bit, so... Not too much to worry about. Yay, whatever these are. So, let's move on. Okay. Let's see. This looks like it's going to be important later on. Huh, something that can be pushed. What else we got? Oh, and I screwed that up again. Okay, I really do need to play this more regularly. Dumb question. Nope, didn't think so. Okay, then. And the clipping is helping me again, once again. So, let's see what we've got here. Okay, there's some kind of symbol that looks like an Omega. And another Omega symbol. Interesting. So, what's up here? Hmm. Can I open this? Hmm. If I can, it's not letting me. Given that it's not colliding immediately, it's, I suppose I could potentially, but I think the focus here is on this. So if I push it forward, what's that going to reveal? Okay, what's that do? I'm not sure I understand what the purpose of that was. What, does this control which door is open? Oh, that's not what I meant to do. Okay, let's try something else then. So if I continue pushing it forward, what happens? Nothing. Okay then, what if I push it the other direction? No, don't climb up. Push. Actually, I probably need to pull it, don't I? Yep. I don't know how that's physically possible, but you know what, video games. I'm just gonna keep hammering on that point. I mean, given how polygonal Lara Croft and most of the character models are, I really shouldn't be complaining, but still. I'm gonna complain anyway, because it's fun. So, if I push it onto this, what happens? Okay, that opens that up. Alright, so I have a feeling that the other way is potentially a secret. Next question. Now I do want to climb up. Can I jump up onto there? Ah, okay. Hmm, maybe. But if I'm gonna do that, I'll want to keep uh, pushing it a bit further, I think. No. Do this. It'll probably close that door. No, it didn't. That's kind of surprising. But, I have a feeling I can use this to jump up here. So, let's. Ah, heck. Okay, let's try again. Come on. Up. Oh, come on. Jump backwards. I guess you're not going to... Heck. I'm gonna make this work, dang it. Or maybe I'm not. I'm going to drive the camera absolutely stark raving mad. But, maybe? Because I know that there's something up there. I can see it. But is there another... Oh, yeah. Oh, I can hang across... I'll have to keep that in mind. I mean, it looks like I can get up there. The question is, do I get up there? No, it doesn't look like it. Come on, I'm going to make this work. Give me a moment. Gotcha! And because I'm gonna be persnickety about this... And that's why... I want my med pack! Well, the problem is that there's no easy way to move slightly forward. It really isn't. So, 
working out the timing on that is a lot more difficult than you would think. I have a feeling this is where a controller would be highly valuable. But... I don't know, not necessarily. Hmm, what, it, what do I have to do for that jump? Because that is obviously the jump that I need to make. Wait a minute, what if I tried making that jump? Ah, heck. It might help if I actually time it up properly. But, I honestly think I can make that other jump. But what do I have to do to get to that point? I mean, it's pretty darn close. Come on. Okay, you know what? It's one med pack. But, but it's a med pack. I'm sorry, I'm going to be persnickety about this. My house, my rules. I'm going to go for it. I'll just skip past all this if I care enough. Gotcha! Finally did get the position right by jerry-rigging exactly where I was facing. So, I have what I want. Now, let's move on. I have a feeling that I can get up there and check out a bit more stuff. So let's save over. See what I can do. Pretty darn close. Hmm. Maybe if I could get slightly more distance. Hmm. Yeah, I think that'll get me a bit more. Because that's effectively what I had to do for everything else. Ah, come on. You know what? Uh, I don't know. Let's just move on and I'll come back here later if I think that there's something worth investigating. For now, though, let's see what's behind curtain number one. And knowing this game... Oh, that's comforting. Oh, that's a monkey! Or is it an ape, technically? Oh, yep, they're apes. on that one, you idiot. Down you go. And with not too much damage taken. Okay, so. Ape. So, apes and lions. Or what look like leopards. Okay, that sounded like it moved something. From what little I did pay attention. So. Oh, this is another leopard. So there are a bunch of different levers here. The question is, what do they affect? That was a bit more painful, but... And there's not even something up here. It was mostly just for gorillas. I'm pretty sure they're gorillas. Okay, so what did that do exactly? Why are there humans? Also, why is their AI awful? Where did you go? No, seriously, where did you go? I mean, what? Huh? Wish I had saved before that encounter. Crap. But yeah, it looks like... Hmm. I don't know. It looks like it's been slightly adjusted, but... It's hard to say what exactly has been affected. Well... Hmm. Looks like that open there... Up there has been opened. So... Hmm. 
The question is, does pulling this do anything? I don't know. Would it, necessarily? Okay, it looks like it did close that door, based on what little clipping I could see. I might be jumping a bit too quickly to conclusions there, but let's see what we can find. No, that's not what I meant to do. Come on. Alright, let's do this. So, I guess now I really do have to go jumping around to get up to places. So where would the best place be to start for that? Over here, perhaps? Probably. Come on, let me up. There you go. Okay, now can I make that jump? Maybe. Okay, don't have a safe to go back on for that. But, I can position myself right at that edge by jumping up to here. Now that I'm on the precipice, I'm in a position where I'm most likely to make that jump. So the question is, can I? No. Not so far as I can tell. What about this jump? Come on, let me make the, let me get up there. Piece of junk. Okay, and that was not the right button. I'm really wishing I had a controller for this now. So. Nope, that's not going to happen. Not so far as I can tell. Maybe it is just a matter of getting up there. Well, we'll see. Hmm. Yeah, let's just get back up here. Actually, yeah, I could... If I can make that jump over there... Heck. Well, at least I can get up that, that jump easily enough. But yeah, if I can make that jump again... No, not that, you pile of crap. <sighs> Welcome to Tomb Raider, the art of failing at platforming. I'm so awful. Okay, so. Now. If I just... Okay, we're up here. Now. Next question. Now that we are up here, can I make use of this vantage point? Let's look around real quick. Looks like I can jump over to there, but it doesn't look like it'll do much good for me. So let's try jumping over here instead. Okay, that's something I can use, hopefully. Now, will it allow me to go this way? Yes. That was close. Nice. So... Real quick, I should probably use one of the smaller med packs. Now, let's take a look around. You're gonna make me drop down onto something, aren't you? Okay. Okay, the position I'm in is making the camera go crazy. Got it. Is that a shark? Is that something that wants to eat me? Oh, it's an alligator! That changes things. I'm, I don't want to go back in there. Even though I'm probably going to have to. But how do I kill that? Oh! It made the water drop. Okay, so now maybe I can do something about it. Ah, heck. I am s Ugh. These controls are weird for me. Okay, here's what we do. We'll jump off this way so that we're facing it. Okay, good. That's probably as little damage as I'm going to get for this. 
Now, I guess this will allow me to move this way without being interrupted as well, which is good. Now, what's up this way? Hmm. Okay, where am I? This looks like just another room. So if that's the case, then where do I need to go to? Hmm. It looks like there's something on t there. It looks like it might be a bat. So next question, can I jump over here? Yes. I hear the bat, but I can't see it. Is it below me? Above me. It's glitched into the wall. Or whatever it is. Ah, heck. That was not what I wanted to do. I should really have accepted that consequence to see where I would end up. Yeah, I'd probably yell too if I did that. Although I will admit that the audio sounded a bit off-balance for it, but you know what? So be it. Huh, this one seemed a little less eager to die. Now. Let's see what this does. Door? Hmm. Oh, hell. Should have freaking saved. Once I had made that initial jump. Well. That was my warning, I suppose. Piece of junk. Ah, well. Let's just worry about this first. Okay, so what is this? So, am I in some sort of Greek? Huh. Am I in some sort of Greek temple? Possibly. <sighs> I hear it! Atlas. Yeah, this definitely has some sort of Greek nonsense to it. It's just a matter of figuring out what. No! Crap. Again, I failed to save. Ah. Uh, wait, did I? This time? Yes, I did. Okay, so I don't lose as much as before. I wish the camera were a bit less derpy. I can hear it, but I'm not sure where it is. Probably below me, knowing my luck. So. Let's get up here. That's obnoxious. Although the blood effect is a little weird. Huh, med pack. Not sure how I'd get over there without getting murdered, but we can at least save. And that's why we save, ladies and gentlemen. Because I'm a freaking idiot. Oh, hey, there's a lever here. Med Thank you, med pack. Okay. Damocles. Okay, I'm trying to remember what... Where, what significance Damocles has in Greek mythology? Because I know about Atlas. Wait, Atlas is Greek. Thor is Norse, isn't it? Huh? Why would Nordic and Greek gods be in the same place? The plot thickens, I suppose. 
Alright, I guess we need to go looking around to find out. So, nothing to jump on over here, so let's try over this way. I imagine I'm eventually going to be seeing what's behind all the doors. Am I allowed back up? I kind of want to get back up, though. Is there a way? Probably not. And given the way that this has been going... Where are we? Okay, so... Nope, that's not how you do it. Okay, so when I... Oh, man, this thing really does require utmost precision. I have to basically press them at the exact same moment if I want the jump button to work immediately. This is such a weird control scheme. This very much feels like it was designed for controllers. I really need to keep that. I wish that... Hmm. I'm half tempted to emulate the PC ver... The PlayStation version. Just to save me some trouble. I don't know if it'll necessarily allow me to use my Xbox controller, but it's something, right? I would hope. Ah, shoot. Not quite what was planned. That's more like it. Okay, so now I can go see what's behind curtain number Thor. Yuck, 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 yuck. I didn't even mean for that to happen. Hmm. Yeah, well, let's just take a look behind here and see what we find. Okay, why is there a disco ball? What? That's what it looks like! Lightning? Why is there lightning? Okay, I have no idea what to make of this. Oh, hi! That was a thing. So, how do I get past the lightning nonsense? Without getting zapped. Oh, there's some sort of... What, did I step on a pressure plate? What if I jump? Yep, there are pressure plates. At least I think that's what that is. So let's just jump straight ahead. Okay, okay it's just not discriminating. So the question is, is there a way to get past that? That doesn't involve taking a metric ton of damage. That I'm not sure of. Well, hmm. So between the lightning and the hammer, I really should have seen this coming. Derp. And now it's just not letting me through. The first time must have been a fluke. Alright, we'll try one more time to brute force this. Okay, so either I need to be more careful, or I don't know. Let's go investigate. We'll use this save if I want to come back here, but let's check everything else out first. So I presume I can just fall down. Aha! Neptune. Okay, so more Greek. Well, technically Roman, but you get the point. So, now we have access to even more of these. So what does Democles look like? That's a lot of swords. I think I want to go back to visit Thor. Okay, so not going to let me jump. Hmm. So each of these has some kind of key by the looks of it. So it looks like I'll need to go through every door 
in order to proceed. So, out of curiosity, where exactly... Oh, crap. No, where exactly are the doors? That's what I need to figure out right now. Where are the doors and how do I open them? So, let's... I know that Atlas is over here. No, the problem is, there might be some before this. I'm pretty sure I did see some earlier. Okay. Now... Let's take a look-see. Alright, so... Neptune's got a door over here, but how do I get back up to Neptune once that I've flipped everything? Because there doesn't seem to be an easy way to get to him. Unless there's... Hmm, you know what? There's probably going to be a way to double back. So... Huh. Do I want to... Well, I'm pretty sure this flips over Atlas. So let's check this real quick. No, this work flips over Damocles. Okay, so... In that case, let's go over to here. And try this again. Okay, I made it this time. Now move past so the hammer doesn't murder you. Oh, please. Do I have to do what I think I have to do for that? <sighs> I'm not entirely sure what that did, but I... But, hmm, it brought this down. Next question, can I move you? Yes. Okay, next question, where should I move you? I imagine if I move you close to this, I can use it to get up here and jump over there. But is that thinking to... No, I don't know, let's try it. Okay, step one, push this forward. Alright, that should get me in position to phase right through it. Oh, come on. That should have worked. Okay, let's try that again. Now, hop! Okay, you're not letting me go directly on top of the hammer? Maybe I don't need it. In that case, let's just try pushing this in general. Maybe I just need to... Actually, yeah, given the height, I probably only need to just get slightly close enough to access everything. The question is, where's the key? If Damocles has a key, then there has to be other keys behind each of these doors. Otherwise, they wouldn't pose them as challenges. Man, these levels are starting to get fairly lengthy. I might have to start breaking them up more. Ah, well, we'll see how it turns out. So, now we jump up here. Climb up here. Okay, so, now we use this. Pull this back. Now, real quick, I'm going to climb on top. Okay, what's this over here? Okay, I've got a way to get back up. I'm curious now. Hmm. I'm not entirely sure. Maybe it has something to do with this? Hard to say. Jump up. Alright. We're getting there. We're getting there. Now, we'll just push it the rest of the way. So that I'm not having to deal with it later. No. Push. There you go. Now, again. Okay, good. Now, one final time. Alright, now, let's head on up. And then head on up again. Alright, what did that win for us? Besides more climbing. Okay, good. 
Now, is it possible for me to jump over there with what I've got? I really shouldn't have used that as a chance to find out. I should have waited until after everything had been pushed over. Because that looks like it would be where I need to go. Question is, how would I get up there? Oh dear, this again. Alright, let me get back to where we were then. So gun shy. 